Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to turn off or disable OneDrive's on this day memory notifications. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu, type in RegEdit, R-E-G-E-D-I-T. Best result, check them back with Registry Editor. Go ahead and right click on that and select Run as Administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And before you proceed in the registry, I would suggest you create a backup of it. So if anything were to go wrong, you could easily restore it back. In order to create a backup, all you have to do is select file and then export. File name, I recommend naming it the date in which you're making the backup. Set export range to all and then save it to a convenient and easily accessible location on your computer. And if you ever needed to import it back in, all you would have to do is select file and then import and then navigate to the file location. So now that that's done, we're ready to begin. And we're going to start off by double clicking on the HK current user folder. Do the same thing now for the software folder. So double click on that. Should be a Microsoft folder in here. Double click on it. Should be a OneDrive folder. Might have to scroll down a little bit. And double click on it should be an accounts folder, double click on that one as well. And then there should be a personal folder, just left click on that one time. Now, if you need to pause the video and take note of our file path, you can see it up at the top of the screen. Each backslash indicates a different sub key that we've gone under to get to this point. So now over here on the right side, you wanna right click in a blank area, select new, and then select DWORD 32 bit value. So just make sure you type in exactly how you see it on my screen, and it is case sensitive here. So you're going to type in on this day photo notification disabled. Again, on this day photo notification disabled, exactly how you see it on my screen. Hit enter, double click on it, set the value data to the number one numerical value, and the base should be hexadecimal. Select OK. And then once that is done, you can just go ahead and close out of the registry editor. And you will need to restart your computer in order for the change to take effect. And there you go, guys. Hopefully this point or issue has been resolved. And as always, thank you for watching. I do a buzz to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.